afternoon at 4. I'm figuring it out. It's coming. All right, I'm ready. Here we go. Let it fly. Hey! <laughs> no more Mr. Stand-In. All right, ladies next, ladies next. Let's get out there, everybody. Come on, Belinda. Myrtle, let's go. You're never too young. You're never too young. If you've been available, You're not going to join? Oh, no thanks. Why not? Here we go. I've sworn off men. <laughs> Do it for Trevor. No, not even for Trevor. All right. Let it rip, babe. Really? Go, gorgeous. Here it goes. All right. Allie. Here we go. I'm chugging, baby. Pop. Hey! <laughs> A loser no more. Yes, sir. Can we come? Oh, not tonight, sweetheart. Why not? I want to go to Hawaii. Hawaii? Where did you get that idea? Ken said all the newlyweds go. Amanda. We're going. We're going. Just not tonight. Oh, wait. I thought we were taking a family vacation. To all the beach? Yeah, to the beaches of Waikiki. After Brooks trial. That sound good? That sounds great. <laughs> all right. Can I get a real hula skirt? Oh, you can, and I want your mom to get one, too. Oh, gee, thanks. So maybe you can wear one tonight, huh? <laughs> but tonight we're going solo. We're going to be at the Valley, and if you need anything, you just call us. Yeah, we'll call you tomorrow morning, okay, sweetheart? We're going to be fine. Just, uh, you guys have fun and relax, okay? Yeah. <laughs> thanks, Tim. Can I get a hug, too? Oh, yeah! <laughs> I was waiting. Bless my mouth. Don't be late for your honeymoon. Come on, come on. Still in the family hug. Time to go. Time to go. Still in the family hug. Think about coming into the office tomorrow. I'm not. Thank you, everybody, for making this happen. Thank you. Thank you. Great, great. Thank you. 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 Bye. All right. Bye. Bye. Enough. I'm giddy as it is. Oh, giddy is good. Giddy up, giddy up, giddy up. Trevor. What? When you asked me to marry you in the church, I couldn't believe what I was seeing. Well, believe it. I was pledging my troth. Whatever that is, what's a troth? I don't have a clue, but it's working. We're having a great honeymoon. Well, Mrs. Axel Green was going to come back to her hotel room and get into her jammies and eat a quart of ice cream. Good choice. <laughs> But Mrs. Trevor Dillon, she's much more creative. Oh, yeah? Where do you see what I have here? What do you think? Do you like it? Hubba, hubba. <laughs> what? <laughs> what are you laughing at? Huh? Us! I just... I have a little bit of the wedding night jitters. I mean, you and I have never, you know, except that once. Gadzooks? <laughs> this could be dangerous, huh? Yeah. Wedding night jitters. 
You never went into that prenuptial hanky panky. I wonder where that was. I mean, what if you don't like it when I do that? Hmm? Not a problem. Yes. Oh. Hmm? I I think we're definitely simpatico. Yeah. In fact, uh, why don't I slip into something a little more comfortable? I've always wanted to say that. I've always wanted you to say that. I'll be right back. Can't wait. Suave, huh? Boy, have I been a saint. How do you figure that? All this time resisting grabbing a hunk of burning love? Well, you don't have to resist anymore. Start loving. Amanda? Sweetie, what's wrong? Amanda, honey, are you, are you okay? Are you sick? How, how did you get here? <sighs> Sorry, Dad. She made me do it. She wouldn't take no for an answer. Well, I missed you. Now that we're a real family, we can all go on a honeymoon together. I took this ABC Wednesday. Mm, this is the best chocolate pudding I've ever had. Chocolate mousse, sweetie. I hope I don't swallow an antler. <laughs> Can I have some of this ginger ale? No. no. Wow, you guys talk at the same time. Just like Harry's mom and dad. Isn't that cool, Tim? Oh, listen, guys, I'm really sorry for barging in like this. I, I know, our timing is really bad, but uh, Amanda will uh, kind of felt out of the loop. It's called separation anxiety. Oh, great. Now our honeymoon is giving our daughter a complex. Sweetie, it's all right. No harm done. I think it's your bedtime, isn't it, sweetie? What is that? No, don't wait. Wait, ask who it is first. Who is it? Harold! What's he doing here? He was feeling left out, too. Oh, great. Now we have a dog with a complex, too. Come here. Oh, no, no, no. Oh, no. no. Tim, not on the bed. I have something to ask under there for Janet. Trevor, how sweet. Tim, get the dog off the bed. What's that in his mouth? I don't know, it looks like a truffle or something. Truffle, my aunt, it's an engagement ring. What? Come well, on. don't let him swallow it. Yeah, yeah, no, come on. Here it is. Oh, yeah. Oh, that was close. <sighs> is that the same ring that you bought when you proposed to me at the mall? Same sparkler. And you kept it all this time? Yep, hope springs eternal. Oh, can I watch you put it on Mommy's finger? I'll make you a deal. You can watch me slip this little baguette on your mommy's digit, and then you gotta scram home to the homestead, okay? Deal? Pardon me while I confer with my associate. I accept your term. Yeah? Shake. You don't trust me? Shake. All right, take a good gander at that. Right there it goes. Look out, hot soup. <laughs> Come, grow old with me. The best is yet to be. Yay! You like that, huh, Tim? Yep. I, I can't get it on your finger. There it is. There it uh, is. Uh, say good thing. night, Mandible. Oh, good night, Mandible. <laughs> good night, Very sweetheart. Don't stay up too late. Yeah. We won't. Come on. Safe drive home, okay? I know. Where were we before we were so rudely interrupted? Oh, it was kind of fun seeing Amanda and Tim and Harold. 
like a big family three ring circus. I loved every minute of it. This is the happiest day of my life. Baby, you're the greatest. How am I doing? Say every line before it happens on screen. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I always dreamed I'd end up with a cowboy. Oh, this ain't the rodeo, but sure is a dream. And then some. Do you ever dream of something so much you could you could taste it? Yeah, I think and, so. And then and then when you finally got it, it's a big B I G disappointment. You know, like like if you. It, I remember when I was a kid, I saw this convertible on the side of the street, and I just fell in love with it. And I, and I had to have it, and it was for sale. And then I found out it had a terminal transi a transmission, something like that, you know what I'm saying? I, I think so. We'll try this on. You get what you're dreaming about. And it's even better than what you thought. Better? Yeah. You don't know what I'm talking about, do you? Not really. <laughs> I'm talking about you, babe. I'm talking about you. Me? Yeah, you. Last night, huh? and then in the middle of the night, oh. and then this morning. <laughs> Interplanetary, super galactic, space warping right to the center of the universe. Really sent you, huh? <laughs> <laughs> Whatever you learn on that other planet, you can run the universe with that. I have never been so <sighs> right down to the tippy tippy of my tippy tippy. <laughs> We're about to start that countdown all over again. Welcome to Dylan World. <laughs> Put your seatbelt on, keep your hands in the ride. I would run. ABC Wednesday. Listen, I'm I'm sorry about this. A I'm thousand apologies. No, you know, under any other circumstances, you know that we the would never come here. The judge Foster is about to rule on whether we should go to trial or not. This morning, now, this morning? Listen, if we want to end a justifiable homicide as a defense, we need to be in the courthouse in an hour. <laughs> you really need me for this. Trevor, if it were any other case, I would argue the motion myself, but it's Brooke. You're I don't right. want to take... Brooke needs full representation on this. Trevor, you have to handle it. Babe, I'm right in the middle of our honeymoon, you know what I'm saying? 
And it's gonna go on for the next 50 years. So get yourself over to court. Brooke needs you at this hearing. Did I marry good or did I marry good, huh? I got Janet G. doing on my side, on my team. <laughs> <clears throat> Counselor. Uh, Trevor. Listen, I know you've got a terrific new wife, and, and I'm really I'm I'm really sorry about the inconvenience, but maybe you should throw in some clothes and, and come to the courthouse with us. I'm just <clears> saying <throat> goodbye for crying out loud. Yeah. Trevor, I'm going with you. I'm just saying goodbye to my honey. It's our honeymoon, honey. I it's your honeymoon. And I want to spend it with my husband. That's why I'm gonna go with you, okay? Wow, isn't she great? I Let's love get you. <laughs> Come on. We'll uh we'll be back in a gif, okay? Okay. Okay. This should be very interesting. At the very least, you have a very unique basis for appeal. How's that? Counsel was so besotted with love that he loused up your case. Could get you a new trial. No, I think I, one time around is enough for me. Let's win the first round, okay? <laughs> what was that about an appeal? <laughs> Go. We'll meet them there. <laughs> you knew. I'm on your planet, but I can understand how you could feel anxious. You didn't expect to be married today, and all of a sudden you got a big lug of a husband, you got two kids, and a big sloppy dog. You can't just come and go as you please anymore. It's 24 hours a day, seven days a week with the kids and, and me. It's a big adjustment. Biggest move of my life. See? Regrets. It's normal. I've got regrets, all right. I regret everything I ever did to hurt you in the past. Uh, enough, enough. I don't want to hear any more about it. We've already covered that. You're a changed person. I don't want to, don't need to talk about it. It's just that I wasted so much time wanting to be somebody else. Anybody else. I figured everybody had a better life than I did. No, I'm not sorry to say goodbye to all this. This life? What, hoping the maid will drop by and turn down the bed so I'll have someone to talk to? Eating dinner by myself every night, watching videos? A big, messy house with kids and a dog named Harold and my favorite man on the planet. That's my idea of paradise. Welcome home, Mrs. Dillon. It's wonderful to be here, Mr. Dillon. What's that smell? Mommy, Daddy, you're home! Uh -huh. Hi, did you guys just get here? Hey, uh, guys, what's that smell? A fish stick. <laughs> well, they were. I burned them. <laughs> we're making supper for you. Well, that's awfully sweet. I hope you like burritos. Love burritos. Oh, great. Uh, they're in the microwave. Where's your bags? Uh, they're in the car. car. Tim, would you be Joe Man and uh, bring a couple of them in for us? No Thanks. problemo. <laughs> what you got? It was supposed to be out, but we couldn't find any tape. Oh, well, we'll stock up on tape tomorrow. Did you do this all by yourself? Tim helped. He printed it up on the computer. Mm. Wow, looking good. Yeah. It would look better if it was hung up. Sweetheart, we'll get it hung up. I just want you to know that seeing your face is the best homecoming I could possibly have. Whoa, Tim, I didn't mean you had to bring them all in at once. Do oh. you want these upstairs? Oh, no, Tim, we can take them up later. Hey. Thank you. Look what I found. Think fast. Hey, let's hang up the banner. Hey, I'll help you.
Kim. It was awfully good of you to help a man to make that paper. It was all Tim's idea. Really? I meant every word. I'm glad you're here. I can't tell you how much that means to me. <laughs> Ta-da! How's it look? Like paradise. Guys, I still smell something burning. Oh, no, the cookies. Cookies? Oh, oh no. Cookies now burning? Still look like paradise? <laughs> Let's go unpack. Um, I even emptied out Daddy's clothes from the closet oh. into the drawer so you can have space in the closet. That's okay. He likes his clothes wrinkly. Come <laughs> on. <laughs> wait a minute, sweetie. Why don't we wait till after dinner to unpack? And isn't there something else you want to show me first? The bathroom drawers? I even put out matching towels. Is it today report card day? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah? <laughs> Sweetheart, uh, what do you say we have a little look-see, huh? Oh. You've always been an excellent speller. Sweetheart, why don't you uh, sit down right here and uh, tell us what's really happening here. You got a warning on your report card and spelling? Oh, can't we talk about this later? You know, like after dinner, maybe? Now's as good a time as any. You see, getting an education is very important. And I know there's been a lot going on here, but... You've got to keep applying yourself. Yeah, you're in all, all these advanced classes because you're sharp. You can't just start goofing off. In fact, you've got to work even harder. But your dad and I, we know you can do it. But it's those T-I-O-U-S words, you know, like repetitious and cautious. Sometimes I get them confused with the C-I-O-U-S words. Loquacious, capricious. I promise to do better next year. Well, um, instead of next year, how about... Tomorrow. Tomorrow? Mm. You mean summer school? I thought you said we were going to be a big happy family. We are. You better get used to it, sweetheart. This is how a big happy family works. Well, dinner was really delicious. <sighs> Sorry, guys. Dinner's ground zero. The burritos are hard as bricks and there's nothing left of the cookies. Pizza! Sounds good to me. I'm not hungry anymore. What's the matter with you? Are you sick? No, I'm to have to go to school all summer. I'm being punished. P-U-N-I-S-H-E-D. Sweetheart, nobody said that you had to go to summer school. All we said was that you had to get better in spelling. You've done so well in your other studies. We're really proud of you. We just want you to do better. I know there's been a lot of distractions. So, wait a second. You mean no summer school? Here's the deal. We'll work on ten new words a day. Yeah, yeah. Uh, breakfast time, uh, Mom or I will give you your new words, and then after dinner, we'll, uh, one of us will quiz you. What do you say? You see, what is that on the computer? Spell, spell check. check. Yeah, spell check is a great thing, but you have to learn how to spell the words for yourself, too. We'll call it the spell check game, and you can both drill me. Okay. Sure, it'll be fun. Yeah, like a game show on TV. Yeah, and... You can quiz me. Lord knows I need some brushing up myself. Deal. This family thing's gonna work out great. <laughs> oh. Tad and I are gonna take you home, Mother. Oh, you doing this? Put me down! How dare you! Amanda snug as a bug in a rug? Uh-huh. Hey, forget about it. Leave it for the maid in the morning. I wish. Yeah, what else do you wish for? Come here, babe. <laughs> Not very much. I'm very happy. Oh, what more could you ask for? Burn burritos and brick hard cookies. Some homecoming, huh? I loved every minute of it. 
I love the banner. I love the pizza. I love you, Mrs. Dillon. I love you, Mr. Dillon. We are still gonna use our first names, aren't we? We used to have your clothes on. <laughs> oh, I wonder if we can fix that. Come on, let's get out of here.